everyone, Libby here. I have another little haul for you today uh, from the last month or so probably. Bits and pieces I've been collecting with spring coming up in Australia. So I will quickly move along. So the first few things I picked up at Priceline, which was the Baptiste, Baptiste Dry Shampoo in Tropical. It smells lovely. Um, I got a little sample of um, the pink one and I quite enjoyed using that. So I went and got this and then thought later on that it's an aerosol and I try not to buy aerosol because <laughs> I know they're not very good for the environment. But anyway, I did buy that and I do enjoy that and I'll have to decide whether I repurchase it when I finish it. I also got the Australis, um, what's it called, the Makeup Finishing Spritz to put on after makeup. I've um, never used anything like this before. I'm trying to make sure it focuses. A bit glary, perhaps. Um, it seems to be quite good. I've used it once or twice. I guess in summer, when your sort of makeup just sweats off your face, that'll, that'll be the, a test of it then. But it seems to be quite good. I've also picked up two lipsticks recently in um, the apricot colours. I actually got one on today. The one I'm wearing at the moment is a cover girl. What's it called? Rapture, this is Rapture, that's another, another, you know, I've got very, a lot of glare today because I've got the blind up, so, anyway, it's number 280 Rapture, that's the colour there, so it's a nice, nice apricot colour, not uh, too pale, with red hair, I don't tend to wear apricots, but I've had a funny, a sudden need for apricot lipstick, so I just went and just picked up two to try. And this was a Revlon Cream Coral Berry. Cute name. So hopefully these, I think I'll hide my face and just, that should hopefully focus. So, and that's, um, they're very, they're quite similar colours. together. I really didn't know what I was doing. One's just a bit darker than the other. So, they both seem to be quite nice. I'm just about, I think, getting used to them as well for me because I pretty much wear sort of like, um, pink sort of raspberry colours I guess. Anyway, you know they're quite fun. And along with the orange, <laughs> I also picked up this Face of Australia uh, from their Barbados range. This one is Orange you Glad You Came. And that was recommended to me by Aggie from, <laughs> I can remember her, her channel's name anyway. The, the same girl who um, linked me for the, what, what the nail tag. Esri, is he blue? Is he blue? Something like that. Anyway, so she recommended that and it is quite nice. I've just taken them off my nails today. Wasn't too sure at first whether again it's suited with, you know, I've got freckly hands. Uh, freckly old hands. <laughs> so I wasn't sure, but I think it was, I think it was okay. Probably can get it from Priceline. I actually picked this up from a chemist. Uh, there's a Burt's Bees sugar scrub in cranberry and pomegranate. So I picked that up, I haven't actually got a proper um, body scrub at the minute. So that's what it looks like inside. I don't really like the smell of it. The smell's not too wonderful, but I haven't tried it out yet either, so I will, I will do that. I picked up a few things in Big W. Actually, how funny if I, I got these in Big W. I did, okay, these came in Big W, but you would get them in Priceline as well. Okay, so I picked up this cute bracelet and I think I'm going to go and get, get some more. Isn't that lovely? Very cute. And because we're going to the to Disney World and the Caribbean on a Caribbean cruise in just two months time now. So those will be sort of fun things to have, very tropical. And I also picked up these earrings. They have some great jewelry in BW and very reasonably priced. So. That's the little earrings that I got. I do try to be very careful um, just to pick up different things, very things that are very different to what I have and in different colours because some things like teals, I know I have so many earrings in teals, but um, I haven't got a lot in that sort of um, more traditional blue, I guess. And with the brown, yeah, so it was quite cute. As you can see, I went back to Big W and picked up another bracelet and pair of earrings. Next, I will do Suzanne. Suzanne's have had some amazing things of late, um, as I tend to do for spring. I've got a few t-shirts, so I picked up this t-shirt. see, just a fairly plain striped grey t-shirt. So I got that. And I also got these other 
I've got a black t-shirt which I think I forgot to bring down but it's just very similar to this and I've got this purple or lilac top just with the cutaway sleeves which I quite like so again very nice light material these would be really good for a holiday because I don't weigh much because I don't want to take much with me because I'm planning on bringing lots of souvenirs back and the other top I picked up at Suzanne's was this floral very sheer very very lightweight three quarter sleeve top I thought that would be pretty on me so again that will be really good for a holiday because it weighs nothing so I really do like Suzanne's I have some great just like everyday things because most of my days are at home um, but I still like to look nice and feel nice too so but then they also have dressier things I don't go out really dressy very fancy <laughs> very often so I don't I just need a pretty basic wardrobe um, so I tend to wear just a t-shirt and their leisure pants <laughs> most of the time especially if I'm at home okay I did order a few things from autograph um, I ordered I've got a nice pink top but I can't remember if I showed it it's like a hot pink top like a little thin strap I don't think I did and it fits perfectly now and I had it also in a greeny tealy color so I and it was on sale so I decided since I'm losing a bit of weight to order a smaller size and yeah, it's a bit snug now but I thought it was uh, I think I got down from the original one I bought was I think 60 and I think I paid 20 for this second one so I thought well, I'll, I'll buy that since it's on sale because I really love the style of top on me it's very very flattering uh, so I thought I'll get it and I'm gonna get well, I'll get a smaller size rather than have two the same size and I also picked up this scarf because I thought this was really cute so with the greens and the blues it's good having a rolly chair for doing doing these videos because I can just roll back <laughs> and show you so yeah so I've got that scarf I think most that wasn't on sale I think that was yeah that was $30 but I had a few things I picked up a few things for Amy on sale online this is a few weeks ago and I had to to qualify for the free shipping or something or other I had to spend another $10 so we ended up getting this necklace which isn't my normal I don't really know if I like it I think it's it was ten dollars anyway, down from thirty. So that's a good deal. I can't quite decide I like it. I haven't even really tried it on yet. I guess I need to try it on, find something to wear it with. Um, if not, so I guess it's a fun piece of costume jewelry. Um, so I decide what I'm going to do with that. <laughs> I quite, I think I like. I do like it. It's just whether it's something I would actually wear or not. If not, I might um, give it away or. Um, See, it reminds me, it reminds me, let's put it away now, but it reminds me of Titanic. <laughs> so that sort of big statement piece of jewelry. So maybe with the right dress that would work. Okay, I also got, where did I get this from? Got a few other, oh, another Big W thing. I was I tried to organise all my things. Now this was from Big W as well. Amy wanted a few scars from this and I saw this one. And I've had a very similar style one, not, maybe not perhaps quite so purpley before. But it's getting a bit frayed. That's the problem with these sort of these light fabric ones. They do tend to sort of catch a bit. But this was the twelve dollars, so I thought, well, that can replace my other one, which I actually have worn an awful lot. Being a nice thin little scarf, I find it, you know, it accessorises really nicely. So that just oh gosh, I'm going back to Suzanne's. Sorry, <laughs> I did. I had everything laid out, and then I've got myself all confused. From Suzanne's, I picked up a couple of bracelets really nice I think I've got another one but I can't quite remember but these are lovely so I think they're about ten dollars each and I think I'm going to go back and get some more of these I don't think I've already showed them to you but perhaps I did and the other thing I picked up from taking the tag off but this is from Suzanne's as well was this scarf another lightweight scarf but I just love the colors the, the navy the teal and the pink and the purple and the white so little frayed edges I think so that's my scarf collection I'm not buying for, for summer for this year I'm not buying any more scarves don't let me buy any more scarves I also placed an order with L'Occitane during the week so I've got this freebie which is what I was after so it's um quite a good one again with coming up for travel I thought Hand you have some more travel size things. I've already had this one and I've used this cleansing foam before, so again, that'll be perfect size. That'll last me the three weeks for overseas. And then they had um, a little brightening water, which I guess is like your toner. 
which I don't have a travel toner so that'll be great for that and then I've got a little Brightney hand cream <laughs> so got that one as well and then they gave a little moisture cream so really uh, good little samples of all the products that I just actually bought so that's good I also picked up another one of my very favorite body lotions so that's the box I'm always raving about it but that's the box that it comes in so it's just the Amande milk concentrate um, with almond milk so I love this I've been using this for years I can't see anything else ever replacing it just a beautiful beautiful cream it just um, soaks in so nicely and it smells good too <laughs> so I've got that and then I haven't had these before but these were a bit of Verbena refreshing towelettes I thought again for travel that'd be great to have it in the on the, especially on the plane I thought that'd be ideal so that's what I got them for just to freshen up a bit I usually have like a little um spritzer of the um one of the mist kind of things but I thought that would be nice too and it says um for hands and body so in the underarms and things like that they'll, they'll probably be really quite handy and then I got oh, excuse the rustle I also picked up another little hand cream because I love the little sample hand creams. So they're ideal for handbags. So this was in Cherry Blossom, which I think is one of the newer flavours. Smells nice. I'm actually having to go to Loxatown shopping the school holidays if I got to Miranda because they've got a few new things I'd like to check out. But they're going to buy much more because I can get it duty free. So, but... Yeah, I must have only wanted a free promotion, so I had to buy it now. And else I'll go through. So there was give a few samples. So I've got another milk concentrate sample, which I probably should even perhaps um keep. And I was thinking of maybe doing a, like a little um favourites for Christmas giveaway or something like that. So maybe it's the kind of thing I could pop in there because the jar's fifty dollars, so I think so fifty. So it's maybe a bit too much to put in a little present box, but maybe something like that can because it is a favourite. And then I've also got a little Precious Cream and a Precious Night Cream. So these are just ideal for if you're going for a night away. <laughs> it's the perfect one dose. Of course, as soon as I finished doing this video, I received two parcels from The Lust Have It, the Normal Pack and the Eco Pack. Both are fabulous this month. Okay, that is my haul. I said that's over the last month, probably four to six weeks I've been collecting those bits and pieces. I'm not supposed to be spending more money as I said it's two months now to go to the States and I really want to <laughs> um, buy stuff there but it is school holidays and we often have a shopping day out so there may be one more haul and I also ordered some OP nail polishes that were super cheap so well, half price so that was as dear as buying them in America so I bought them online here so anyway they may be another haul more than likely um, before we go so anyway take care it's um yeah middle School holiday? Yeah, it's Tuesday in the school holidays, so long weekend coming up here in Australia. So I hope you have, a, hope you all have a good time. If you're going away, we're going up to Sydney, I think, at least on a Saturday anyway. All right, I'm going to go. No more rambling. Okay, talk to you later. Bye.